Some people from our area are also rushing out to help. 10 News reporter Shane, Shane Dwyer met up with the Franklin County woman who just returned home from the front lines. Betsy Haynes is a fixture here at the Booker T. Washington National Monument, just a stone throw from Smith Mountain Lake. Here, she's a park ranger, educating our community on the Civil War. But for the last 30 years, she stood ready to trade her ranger hat for fire gear, and this year was no different. Normally, we'll have a helmet, our boots. She's been home just days and isn't even unpacked yet. Betsy Haynes is back in Franklin County after deploying out west. I actually put my name on a list on September 1st and I, I immediately got called on September 2nd to come help out. And I got called out as an individual resource and I actually went to two fires. Normally a park ranger at the Booker T. Washington National Monument, she helped on possibly the worst wildfire season ever, sharing critical information on the media team, but still close to danger. We could hear trees cracking and falling down. I mean, big huge trees just in the woods not too too far away so we knew that it was the fires are still going they're just in, contained within the line but think of that as her wildfire retirement gig she started in 1991 and for 18 years faced the flames head on covered in soot always with a smile i did the step test then i was getting boots and then all of a sudden i was on a fire on the blue ridge parkway luckily my first fire was on the blue ridge so i learned everything about digging line and all that in the beginning the work is demanding and the conditions are deadly but haynes rarely says no and whether it's teaching history or cleaning up back in virginia she's better for it but it just sort of gets me out of my comfort zone and out of uh, just being where I usually am and it's just sort of a nice escape from that challenge to a different challenge. Haynes says she's needed back here at the park, so she probably won't be making any more trips out west this fire season, but she and her gear will be ready to go back out west next fire season if the call comes. In Franklin County, Shane Dwyer, 10 News, working for you.